Good morning! Hi guys, today's Thursday and I just walked in my house. I actually had a lash appointment at 8 a.m. this morning. It is now 10.30. I'm about to go through my son's clothes because I need to put all his winter fall clothes in his drawers and his closet and take out all his summer stuff. So that is one thing I have on the agenda today. I also need to go to Whole Foods. Uh, oh, let me ask you all this. If you guys shop at Whole Foods and you guys shop at Trader Joe's, which one do you think have better prices or better stuff? Like, I have never been to a Trader Joe's, but I want to visit. I want to go to a Trader Joe's to see the comparison because a lot of people say that Trader Joe's is a little bit cheaper. <laughs> it's a little bit more doable is what folks say. The creamer that I use for my coffee, only place I find that is Whole Foods. So yeah, I just wanted to start off the vlog here. I'm actually off uh, for the next four days. Yay me, worked two days this week. Love it. And I'm not back until Monday. I'm sprucing up my place a little bit. And then I'm cleaning up, right? I have all my bags downstairs, like my handbags my sunglasses like I, I have all kind of stuff down here that i need to take upstairs with me then i got all the stuff right here that we use for my son's hair that i need to pick up take upstairs and then i have my oh only see my nails let me show them my nails let's focus all right this is what my nails are looking like let me show you know, that i just had done so these two nails broke and they were breaking from down in here. So I had to cut my nail because once it's breaking from down in here, you, you, you know, if your nail ever broke from down here, so you know it hurt. And then look at my cuticles. What the woman say? She give me one manicure. Tell me, when I can't say that, this is a mess. So here we go. This is mostly his summer stuff. I'm going through his, these pants from last year to see what i think can fit these actually are stuff that i just bought a lot of his pants from last year can't fit because the kid is growing like a weed when i tell you i bought these last year and these can't fit him this year i bought this little outfit from the gap it cannot fit him they're too small i wouldn't even recommend buying these from the gap because i feel like they shrunk so that's that on that what time is it 12 o'clock so it's time for me to break my fast and i'm going to make some coffee oh no, i'm gonna do my lemon water warm water and lemon and then drink the coffee guys today's friday i started to vlog yesterday but I don't know what happened. I think I recorded two or three clips and that was that. <laughs> so we gonna start off back today because I don't know what was going on with me yesterday. I am about to go to Walmart to pick up a few things. Um, I have these Guinness bottle too that I need to drop off. Return my bottles because we paid his deposit on these bottles, y'all. Let's head on into the Walmart. I haven't been to Walmart in such a long time as well. Let's see what they got. And it's early. That's good because you know you want to beat the people coming up in here. I'm back home from Walmart. Let me listen. I just spent $140 in Walmart, and if I show y'all what I got, I let me show y'all what I got. It's not worth no hundred of oh. I forgot about all these jogger outfits. That's why. Because I bought five pieces and each of them was $10. So that's $50 off the rip plus tax. So never mind, never mind. <laughs> I forgot. I'm like, what'd you spend $140 for a, a little bit of grocery? But it, I only got like toilet paper, cleaning stuff. Nothing crazy, you know? These are the pieces that I picked up. I actually just picked up the pants in a bigger size because I have this color already from two years ago and they hold up pretty well. And then I got the black pair and then I got this navy blue pair because I'm about to work out because sister and I are going to the mall and then we're going to have lunch and we kind of like to go early and I told her 11 30 and it's now 10 15 so let me work out real quick because honestly if I don't work out now I am not gonna work out later let's go
school called me and told me that my son was throwing up and he felt nauseous and I had to come pick him up but he was just spitting up a lot of mucus and coughing a little bit he has no fever he has a runny nose allergy season you know so i had to go pick him up from school so that little bit of workout you saw me doing that was just me warming up i had to cut that stop that and go to the school pick him up now i'm back home i'm just gonna go ahead and get ready to head on out i am ready to go let me show you oh, this is just water oh i'm listening to people's school hold on not the sun honey on my skin honey hey anyways my sister is downstairs let's roll out spicy did you just up on angela your podcast and they asked her if she masturbates and she said no because when you do that yeah i'll fix with with dopey succubus and bookabus <laughs> <laughs> fell right out of this but this is so cute i guess you got to be a part of the itty bitty committee for this I'm back home. It is 7:42, but I probably walked in the house 15 minutes ago. Today was a great day. I picked up a few things from Aritzia, and then Zara was a vibe, so I got a few things from Zara as well. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow, probably a date night with a hubby, because my mom is going to watch my son for the night. Good morning. Actually, it's not morning. It is 12 noon, and I just got back from laundromat. Today's Saturday. Let me show y'all what's cooking up on my stove right now. Chef O'Neill. We, well not we, because we just come home to this. This is Aki and Sawfish. This is actually Jamaica's national dish. The chef don't get any noise. Hello. Okay, see chef there. But guess what? He cooking aki and sawfish and a dumpling in court. Didn't I tell you the other day that I'm trying to stay away from dumpling because I'm trying to get back into eating ketogenically? And then I come home and this man I cook aki and sawfish and dumpling. It's the weekend. You can't cheat on the weekend. <laughs> I want to know what I'm going to eat. I'm going to have two dumplings. Yeah, right. Uh, what do we have up today? Nothing really. Trying to go on a date night tonight and we have no reservation made because it already come up. My son still is gonna go to my mom's house. Even if we end up go a one hole in the wall, we still gonna take it. It is cold outside, fall. It's truly fall in Michigan. Anyways, let me go fold my clothes, eat something, and I'll catch up back with you guys. Let me show you my new kettle. I had to buy a new kettle because my other kettle, I pop up a picture of how it was. I tried to scrub the other kettle that I have. The black outside, I don't know what kind of cheap mess that was, came off. So I picked this up in TJ Maxx. How cute is this? This was 24 bucks. I love the handle on this. I'm about to actually make some coffee right now. It's 1.30. I just ate two dumpling you know what i hate i hate folding clothes it took me all the time to fold up those clothes i don't mind doing the laundry but folding the clothes just irritates myself anyway i'm trying to make a americano with this pumpkin spice 
syrup that I got yesterday. Still taste this on my coffee this is kind of like keto coffee because i use heavy cream i normally put mct oil in my coffee i didn't but i will let me show you the mct oil that i use and if you're not used to mct oil start off with a little bit so i did a pumpkin spice let me try this and then i put cinnamon of course this actually tastes really, really good. I'm gonna sip my coffee, start probably editing some footage and relax. Today, I'm just gonna relax. Uh, I'm gonna work out later on before I take my son to my mom's house. We're gonna go sing the king, see the king women. Do y'all have a house phone? I still have my house phone ring. Do you guys have a house phone? Let me tell y'all this. So my mom, hold on. The people that tend to call the house phone is just, random foolishness but i digress my mom is the one that told my sister and i that we have to have a house phone we were like for what she's like anything can happen with a cell phone and blah 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 blah, blah. you have to have a landline so i have a landline my sister have a landline because our mother told us that we need to keep a landline literally my sister never uses her landline I don't use the landline but my mom is like mm -mm, you have to have it i don't care what's going on you have to have a landline do you guys still have a landline phone in your house comment down below and let me know but anyways so what was i saying we're gonna go see the king women that movie so we're just gonna go eat see the king women and just have a chill little date night hey guys it is 8 p.m at night and it's a bit nifty and cold so i am wearing a blazer a sweater and my leather jacket we are gonna attempt to go eat some food we couldn't even get any reservation so we're just gonna kind of wing it hey y'all hey y'all <laughs> <laughs> Look at this guy. He's <laughs> just say hey y'all. Uh, so we just had dinner at Bonefish Grill. It was our first time being there. I put my name down on the wait list for this place. I wasn't hearing anything, so we decided that we were gonna drive to Bar Louis. If you live in Metro Detroit area, you know Bar Louis, you can just walk in and the, the food is not that great, but the drinks are okay. While we were going to Bar Louis, I actually got a text message that said our table was ready. The main course hmm, wasn't that great, but the appetizers were amazing. Oh, the drink. What was the name of that drink? Tropical Heat. Tropical martini. Heat Martini? Mm -hmm. Yo, let me tell them something about a drink today. I think I'm a martini girl because yesterday the sister and I had lemon drop martini and that was the first time I was having lemon drop martini. First drink only you get, he didn't like it. So he ended up getting the martini with me like for a second round. Yeah, we had two rounds of drinks, honey. So now we're going to the movies. Oh, y'all. O'Neill was already betting me in the restaurant. He was like, I'm gonna bet you that you're gonna fall asleep. <laughs> <laughs> because the movie is two hours and in what 10 like minutes? 14 minutes Ten, two hours and 14 minutes my sister saw this movie and she was like i didn't fall asleep it was a great movie i dropped my son off at my mom's house and my brother was there and my brother said he went and saw the movie as well already and he said it was amazing he liked it we'll see cousin oh, i don't make a dip on right now especially <laughs> in just make me drink two drinks <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna try my best though. If I something will keep me engaged, we'll see. This vlog is a chatty ass vlog. I've been talking for two days on this. <laughs> <laughs> I do nothing these two days but talk to y'all and just talk random stuff. You're, but you're I talking mean, two days consecutively. Yes, right? Continuously also, right? <laughs> <laughs> not really. Not really continuous, but I mean I didn't really do much these couple of days, but I mean it's vlogtober, so I'm just gonna vlog, you know? I appreciate those of you who do watch the vlog videos and not just my nursing content. I really, really, really appreciate you guys. I know I'm on the platform and I speak nursing all the time, but you know, there's other side of us nurses. You know, let's head to the movies and I will catch you guys 
in a minute. Good morning y'all. It is Sunday. It's 9.42 in the morning. If you hear something in the back, I have the kettle on the stove and I'm going to make some tea. Last night, I did not end the vlog because I came in at 1am in the morning. That movie was amazing. The King Woman. I'm shocked that I actually stayed awake because typically I don't like to watch long movies. If I'm at home, I'll do it because I can wake up and rewind and stuff like that. A couple of people in the back of us was just knocked out and they were snoring. My husband said, nobody next to him can just shake him because I fallen asleep in the movie theater already and start snoring loud and my husband just, you know, kind of gently shake me so that I can stop snoring because it's the entire movie theater and then when everybody was leaving they were still in the back knocked out y'all i am about to edit this video that should go up today uh this video is just random of me lots of talking lots of shopping oh speaking about shopping i ordered some stuff from coach and i wanted to show you guys these two pieces that i ordered so this is a pair of shoes um look at this oh this is so nice i'm pretty sure i paid about 80 dollars for these let me show you guys these are giving me sophistication love them i also got a bag because i I wanted a color bag like this. Oh. Oh, we. At first, I thought it was going to be a little bit too small. So, this is the bag. The color is just really nice. This is so cute to me. To wear top handle and then when you do it cross body let's see because I'm 5'9 so I love the size of this when it's a cross body love it so yeah I think I am gonna keep that but that is it for this week's vlog or these couple of days don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel I'm about to edit this video drink my tea and I will see you guys tomorrow because i am working tomorrow so i might yeah i'll vlog my nursing day tomorrow and do some hopefully some educational stuff if anything interesting comes to the urgent care all right bye guys